posting your email picture. In this video, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be quickly talking about hosting your and how you're going to be having your hosting your emails have a proper picture. Now, obviously, you probably use Hostinger as your business domain or business email provider. Now, if you do use that, then obviously, in your case, you're going to go ahead and need a proper email startup. Now, when you're sending a business email, obviously, you might find it better that your email has a profile picture. So if that's the case for you, then this video is definitely for you because I'm going to be quickly showing you two to three simple steps where you can add an email to your picture. Now for this, do know this, that you are going to need to have Gmail and obviously you're going to have to connect your hosting or email to your Gmail. Okay. So if we've got that out of the way, let's start ahead with it. Now, first of all, what you're going to do is you're going to have your hosting or email readied up and you're going to be at the C panel of your hosting or email. Now, I don't currently own a hosting email to give you a proper tutorial on the hosting or side, but I can show you what you're going to need to do. So what you're going to want to do from here is once you have your hosting or C panel open, you're going to go over to your Gmail. Now, once you go over to your Gmail, what you're going to do from here is you're going to click on the top right section. And once you click on the top right section, you're going to go over to your settings. Okay. Now, once the settings opens up, you're going to click on see all settings. And once we click on see all settings, it's going to open up a page like this. Now over here, what you're going to want to do is you're going to go ahead and add hosting or as an email to your Gmail. So what happens through that is when you send an email through hosting or people are going to see your Gmail profile picture. So that basically alternatively connects your hosting or to your Gmail and gives you a proper profile picture to work along and act with. So again, what we're going to do is we're going to come over to our settings, click on accounts and import. Now, once you come to accounts and import, what you're going to want to do over here is here, it's going to say send mail as, okay? So once you come to send mail as you're going to click on add another email address. Now, once you click on add another email address, what you're going to do over here is first of all, you're going to go ahead and add your name for that email. So obviously don't go ahead and add your business name, whatever your business name is. So let's say in my case, it's John L. Okay. Now, once we do that here, an email address, what you're going to do is you're actually going to write your hosting or email. Okay. So what you do is you go ahead and add in whatever your hosting or email is. So let's say I'm going to add something like that. Okay. So let's say that's my hosting or email. I'm going to click on next step. Now, if you're hosting your email now over here, what it's going to do is it's going to open up your email that you use. And what's going to happen is what you're going to want to do is just go through your provider's details and everything. And through the C panel, just add your main C names, your A records. And once you do that, what that will successfully do is connect your hosting or to your Gmail as your leading email provider. And then what's going to happen is any business email you send through hosting or will be sent as an alternative to your Gmail. And obviously when you're sending an email as an alternative through your Gmail, obviously that business emails profile picture is set it up as your Gmail profile picture. So in that case, your issue is resolved and now you have an hosting your email profile picture. So that is pretty much about it. That is how easy and simple it is to get a hosting or email profile picture. Now, if you enjoyed this video, please do make sure to drop down a like and subscribe to the channel. And if you want to see more videos like this in the future, do let me know down in the comments below and I'm going to be making a whole lot more for you. Till then, that is all from me and I'll be seeing all of you in the next video. Have a great day. Goodbye.